Right now I want to show you how to draw Lewis dot structures for polyatomic anions and polyatomic cations or what that means is just they've got covalent bonds but overall charge. So remember we've already memorized all those polyatomic anions. NO2 minus is nitrite. Remember NO3 minus is nitrate but NO2 minus nitrite anion. Now let's draw the Lewis dot structure for this. Well we know that the nitrogen is going to be in the center because oxygens don't like bonding together unless they have to. Nitrogen is in group 5A, so there's five valence electrons. Oxygen is in group 6A, so there are six valence electrons. Where those two are going to bond together. And now each one of those atoms has seven valence electrons. Two, four, six, seven, two, four, six, seven, two, four, six, seven. None of those atoms are happy. And we've got to remember that that extra electron, so the negative charge means there is one extra electron that needs to go into this structure. So we could put it right here on the nitrogen and make it happy, but actually it's going to want to go towards the more electronegative atom. So which one is more electronegative, nitrogen or oxygen? Well, oxygen is, so we'll give that oxygen its extra electron, and now it will have a negative charge because there are two, four, six, eight electrons around that oxygen. It's happy it's got its octet, but we had to actually put in that extra electron from that negative charge so we give that oxygen now a formal negative charge. It used to have one, two, three, four, five, six electrons. Now it's got an extra seven. It has a negative formal charge. Now over here what do we need to do to make this nitrogen happy? We have two, four, six, oh look we have these two unpaired electrons. We can bond. So now this oxygen has two, four, six, eight. This one has two, four, six, eight. This one, two, four, six, eight. All those atoms are happy with their complete octets. And we can redraw giving that lone pair its space and drawing each one of those regions as far away as they can get. And we see the Lewis dot structure for the nitrate anion. Now, remember that there's two ways you could have drawn this. You could have put the double bond here and the single bond there. So we call those resonant structures. And the resonant structure is denoted using arrows and brackets. So they're just two structures for the same molecule 